An accused murder is behind bars tonight. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Lauren Freeman. I'm Bill Baessa. It's an update to a story we first brought you earlier this week as breaking news. Tonight, police say Jeremiah Carter shot and killed Yusuf Amsari outside of Fuzzy's Pizzeria in West Houston. Ryan Korsgaard is joining us live tonight. Ryan, we're now learning more about what led to this shooting, correct? Bill, we have a better idea now. First of all, we know that he had a meal right back here at the Golden Chick and then came next door here to the parking lot in front of Fuzzy's Pizza. The big question is, why would there, was there a disagreement here? 19 year old Jeremiah Carter sits in jail charged with murder. He is accused of shooting 26 year old Yousef Alsmarie to death outside Fuzzy's Pizzeria in West Houston on Monday. New details are revealed in court documents. Police say Carter and a woman were inside the Golden Chicks restaurant next door just before the shooting. Court documents read that the woman was there to fill out a job application. Police say they used that job application to find the woman on Facebook. That led them to Carter's Facebook page and a picture of him with a pistol that matched the description of the one used in the shooting. They say he also matched the description of the shooter. Police also said they further identified Carter by using a previous jail booking photo. And the verbal argument escalated and one of our, our shooting suspect uh, pushed our complainant, our victim. The, uh, the victim pushed him back. That was the investigator on Monday right after the shooting. Investigators say that at least three people tell them that Carter and Alice Marie got into a verbal then physical fight. They told police that Carter pulled a pistol out of his pocket and shot Alice Marie to death. The uh, suspect produced a handgun and uh, started shooting our victim multiple times. Police said that Carter hid out at his mother's house before his arrest. They tell us that Carter has confessed to the shooting. If police know, they have not said what led to the fight. Now, by the way, the victim's family not talking. They say it is simply too painful. We're live today. Ryan Korsgaard, KPRC, Channel 2 News.